Hello everyone, this is Ultra Dark Slayer coming to you to my YouTube channel. Uh, I would like to say uh, there's some news on the Xbox uh, um, community and along with PlayStation and Nintendo. So let's start with Xbox news. And uh, as you all know that let's um, as you all know the acquisition of um, uh, Activision Blizzard joining with xbox is still underway and and surprisingly they are um um microsoft they are getting uh, held by by the union with the the c double a i mean the c w a um uh, uh company that that did that that, that they're help, they're helping microsoft to have the union to to make sure that this acquisition does go through because they the the union of that company does uh, want the workers from you know uh, Activision Blizzard to have a good working environment. As you all know, uh, during the beginning of the year, we've been hearing stories of uh, that that popped up that 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 the the people in charge or were in charge of Activision Blizzard were are are being filed by doing insane things, you know, harassing women, taking them to clubs, and also inside within the work environment, which is not a good thing to do when, when you're doing a work when you, uh, at the place you like to do to make games, and this is why this union company, the, CW, the CWA, is helping Microsoft, making sure that this Activision Blizzard contract does go through and I personally do want this acquisition to go through and and I know that on Sony's side um uh it's it's gonna hurt them because as you all know Call of Duty is big on the Sony community and and it, and I hate to say this but I think Xbox and Microsoft did did a good thing on jumping on doing this acquisition and I want this acquisition to go through I mean not just because like oh I have an Xbox but I also have a a PlayStation 4 still um I'm still uh I'm giving my my PS4 a break but in time I will get a, a PlayStation 5 just playing the games that I want to play but in any case I do want this acquisition to go through and and of course Microsoft did say that they will still make games for Sony, but in a way that they will not get those, you know, big hits. But they'll get something either way. And also within Xbox, they did announce, they did send a letter, I'm pretty sure, on, on Twitter saying that by October 1st with their uh, Golds program that they will stop putting 360 games in the Gold lineup. You know, when you get your, your free games for in, in, with your Gold membership and you get those free games and then and then they're, they're yours, right? But this is going to end on October 1st. So no more 360 games are coming to the, the lineup for Gold. But the games that you did uh, redeemed, and it's inside your library, they're still yours. They're not gonna go away. They're still your games, even with uh, if you're still subscribed or not. You're, they're still your games, you know. And so what I'm thinking that that oh okay, so they're gonna stop putting 360 games on the gold lineup, and they're gonna do Xbox One games, more Xbox One games, and down the line some series games that were exclusive to you know that are exclusive to 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 the new xbox which is to me it's a good idea so that way people could probably be like oh even though i have you know a game pass this game is free for me to download to actually own you know with the with the copyrights and all that but so that's a good thing i think they should start moving away from the 360 lineup with gold and start putting in Xbox One games and a couple of series games 
you know, that people are trying to get their hands on either on the sale or something like that. But having a free series game from their new library that that they have right now would be a good idea. So um so that's it for 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 that Xbox news. And now for the Sony side. Sony fans, I mean why 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 are you guys were harassing the developers of God of War demanding begging screaming at, at the developers of the of the God of War team that they are try they, they they have been trying their best to get something going and they did they launched a trailer today this morning of God of War Ragnarok we saw uh Kratos' son uh, as a young teenage young man and of course Kratos is a, a little bit older o older and you guys finally got your trailer you got your teaser trailer. You got the release date for an actual trailer that's coming out. That's coming out later this year in November. Okay, it was it's so it was so disgusting that that I had to hear that from other YouTubers doing that kind of news about people sending junk pictures to the developers, harassing them, and demanding that. That we need something. We need an update. Give me an update. You'll get an update. And you did. So you got your update. You got your teaser trailer. And you'll see more of it in November. So guys. Stop harassing the developers. Of, of, the, the, of the game that you were so hungry for. So. So that's enough. So that's that's the end of uh, PlayStation News. That I, That's all I have to say about that. And uh. For Nintendo, Nintendo did launch a special trailer for uh, for platoons for you know the the the, the, the platoon game three, the Squid Game. I'm calling it a Squid Game because I never played uh, platoons, and um, and they launched a an OLED version of Splatoon themed based. And it looked kind of cool, um, uh, and also that uh, of course you might have heard that rumors are going on in, in in Nintendo that they might bring out a next generation Switch console, a Pro Switch console, which we all know that you know in the the the, the OLED had a uh, had a dock that can perform 4K, which means that we might get a uh, uh, a Switch 2 or a Switch Pro. Hopefully we might hear more probably either this month or next month during the, the Tokyo Game Show or who knows when they'll do a, a proper direct and hopefully that they, they would because um, uh, we, we, we're, 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 we're hoping we're hoping we're, we're hoping that that'll happen and uh, I think that's all I got for, for, for about that. But let's go back to uh, one more Xbox news that that um, that that I forgot to mention. On the Xbox side, there have been rumors that that we might get some sort of um, some sort of a handheld Xbox. Uh, I mean, Xbox are doing you know their their ecosystem within the phones tablets uh laptops p uh desktop pcs and of course now samsung tvs with their app via cloud but um people would like to have a a native portable handheld xbox device i mean it's 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 not it's it's possible that they could probably do that you know they could take schematics from the series s slim it down probably the size of the switch i mean i mean they can they can probably do it you know they could try to compete you know the handheld market natively native handheld portability 
you know, like the Switch is doing, and now the Steam Deck, and then they want to, if, if the rumors are true, they're, if they're trying to do like a handheld, that will be pretty cool to actually get in more within the Xbox ecosystem as well. I'm not saying no, I'm not saying yes, this is just a rumor. For me, it's just a grain of salt if they would do it. Other people are expecting a pro version of the Series X or probably like a pro version for us for the Series S with a disk drive. And we're still waiting for like some type of um, uh, native Blu-ray disk, uh, disk reader for the Series S. Or just make a Series S with a with a disc drive. So um, so yeah, we, we we would never know if Xbox would, Microsoft and Xbox would enlighten us about that. Probably maybe we'll hear something from from them again at Gamescom. Um, that's coming up later. Um, we're not sure, but in any case. That's probably all the news I got for now. And uh, if I'm missing any any more news of both Xbox, Sony, Nintendo, let me know in the comments down below. I am going to leave the comment window open for everybody. And um, just let me know your thoughts if you want to hear more news. And, um, and yeah, that's all I got, guys. I... Hope you have a good day, have a good night, have a good afternoon where you are in the world. Stay safe out there. Take care of yourselves. Peace.